Hello and welcome to this overview of Salfeld Child Control's Internet Filtering Function. The Child Control application uses the Windows logins already present on your computer, so there's no need to add additional logins to the Child Control application. I'll select Peter from the drop-down. Only Peter's settings will be affected. Internet filtering options are found here on the left side menu under Internet Filter. You can see at the top we have four options. If for any reason you don't wish to have the internet filtered, this first option disables all internet filtering. The next option allows you to filter out unwanted websites and URLs. All the URLs related to the checked categories are filtered, as well as the URLs and keywords on the next tab. To help protect your child, Salfeld has put intelligence behind category filtering. There are millions and millions of URLs that are used for filtering, and more are added each day. Another layer of protection is the search engine filter. What this does is engage the search engine's native filtering for unwanted content. Unwanted URLs and keywords are captured here under prohibited terms and prohibited websites and URLs. The next option is the reverse approach, where you specify only the URLs that will be allowed. It's important to note that allowed URLs are not filtered against your unwanted keywords. Child control is highly configurable, and even within the allowed URLs, you can configure time restrictions. I'm going to save these configurations for Peter. If I had forgotten and tried to move on to a different screen, Child Control would prompt me asking me if I wanted to save my changes. The application is intelligent and will let you know if further configurations are required. Here we see that additional URLs are required to properly restrict yahoo.com. Should it be necessary to completely disable internet access from this PC, this is the option you would choose. Child Control double checks just to make sure this is exactly what you'd like to do. The Internet Programs group under the Programs option on the left side menu is where filtering is applied to. This is important if new browsers are installed in the system they will be properly filtered as well. Here under Logs, you can review the top URLs. These are the URLs where the most time is spent. From any entry, you can double-click and further set parameters around that URL. The log details contain a wealth of information. The elapsed time spent on the PC and on the internet as a whole can be viewed here. And we can also drill down and look at the sites where the most time is being spent. When you select a site from the list, it wants to know if you want to always block it or just apply a time restriction. I'm going to select yes to always block arsenal.com. It's been my pleasure to present Southfield's Child Control Application Internet Filtering Function. I hope you found this tutorial useful and will watch the others in the series as well.